Now, ready or not, they've started busing migrants to upstate counties. But this is already receiving major pushback from local leaders. And now this battle heads to court. No hate, no fear. Immigrants are welcome here. It's a day-to-day -day scramble trying to find housing for migrants in New York. And it could soon get worse. It's just wrong what is happening to New York City. It's wrong. And no one seems to care. At least three upstate counties are declaring state of emergencies to try and block the arrival of any new migrants. Orange County, Rockland County, and now Broome County. Rockland County also issued a temporary restraining order. The Rockland County Supreme Court backed up this restraining order on Thursday with its own temporary order blocking Adams from sending migrants to the Armani Inn. Adams responded to the pushback he's been receiving from county leaders, pointing particularly at Rockland County Executive Ed Day. How he responded to this, really, it shows a lack of leadership. Uh, you know, I thought he was the Texas governor, the way he acted. But despite this state of emergency, the city sent two buses with migrants to the Crossroads Hotel in the town of Newburgh. Orange County Executive Stephen Newhouse issued a scathing statement saying they were never notified that these buses would be arriving. Quote, the process has been a disorganized disaster. Sadly, we have learned that you cannot trust the word of New York City's mayor and the leadership of New York. City leaders are also calling for a more organized solution to this crisis. Why, after a year, are they scrambling to figure out what housing looks like? They have not presented us with a long-term plan. Around 500 migrants are arriving in the city every day, and that number could soon double after Title 42 is lifted. Mayor Eric Adams signing an executive order late Wednesday night that temporarily suspends part of the city's right to shelter law. Commissioner of Immigrant Affairs Manuel Castro says they are running out of options. Asylum seekers that show up to New York City today, tomorrow, in the coming days and weeks might end up in the street. And that is not something we want to see. And today, the New York Civil Liberties Union announcing a lawsuit against Rockland and Orange counties challenging their state of emergencies, blocking migrants from arriving in their districts. Reporting live from City Hall, I'm Morgan Mackay. Stephen Natasha.